Well, good morning. It's Saturday morning in August of 2017, and we are on the road on I-95, heading to, where are we going? Columbia. Columbia, South Col Carolina. Where we're going to see the solar eclipse tomorrow. For and two minutes and 30 seconds. All this for two minutes? Okay. Leslie's driving very nicely. I drove for a few hours. We have about eight hours left of driving to go where we just passed Vero Beach in Florida and uh, heading north. So we'll see you in Columbia. So now it's uh, fast forward to Columbia, South Carolina where Hi. we arrived yesterday after uh, an 11 hour trip. And it's about 10 minutes to go till totality, but it looks like we're under a pretty uh, deep cloud cover, so I don't know hopeful. if we're going to see something. Anyway. And we saw a lot already, so it's okay. Well, let's see how dark it gets. Okay. Something will happen. Well, we're here with uh, about 10 minutes to go to the eclipse. We're now in Columbia, obviously. It took us almost 11 hours to get here. So we're just waiting and seeing if this cloud cover will will uh, let, let up, but uh, we've been watching it on TV. It's spectacular in other places. Unfortunately, the sun is completely obscured by clouds. Lights are coming on. Automatic street lights are just coming on. It's, it's much, it's much brighter on the horizon. I'll turn the camera around. There. But if you look up, a lot of cloud cover there. Now it's really dark. It's really getting dark now. See? Street lights. Alright, so it's it's 241 right now. We're looking we're looking up at the sky for the sun, but we can't see it. It's behind some clouds. It's too bad. You see that? It's like there's a sunrise on the horizon in almost all directions where it's light. But overhead, it's dark. It's like night here. It's totality. Twilight. Twilight. That's inside. You can see street lights. Let's see how long this lasts. Oh, I wish we had, could see the sun. The sun is up there somewhere. It's dark enough so that you really couldn't even read a book by the amount of light that's here. It's the lights inside the hotel. When you see normally see twilight, you don't see it. Yeah, it's twilight everywhere on the edges. We're still in the time of totality, but time is running out. It's still 43, but it'll be over in less than 
I think it's, yeah, it's going to be over in less than a minute. I, I, th I feel it's starting to lighten now. It's, it's starting to lighten now. So I'm sorry. I tried. Oh, I'm not sorry. This is so exciting anyway. We saw a partial eclipse, which was cool. And I like the feeling. It's cool. It's an amazing phenomenon. Yeah, anyway. it is amazing. Oh, now look. Now it's really getting much brighter. Yeah. Look. Now this is almost oh, right overhead. Oh, cool. Look at this. It's bright. It's bright again. It's getting bright, so... Oh, wow. Uh, just in seconds, in just seconds, you can see that things are lightening up again. So totality is finished. And it's, uh, it's getting quickly getting... Like night to day. Um, very cool. It's very interesting. All right, we're going to have to make a trip to Arizona in 2024. Okay, so, Arizona, here we come. It's 2023, and that's the annual eclipse. So don't see totality. 2023. Oh. So now we're going back to Florida. Welcome to Florida. Always good to come home. Here's the sign. Florida welcomes you. Leslie's driving again. Doing a good job. I drove all through Georgia. Yeah. Alright. That's the end of this trip. <laughs>